okay. Um, let's get to the top five then. Let me get my, let me get my list. Do you want to do you want to do like we did last time with the three clues, the or do you do you want to? Oh, do that might be. I was it thinking, might I was be th tough this time. I might. I was. I was thinking about doing a a quote that can hint at uh. Like, like a, a quote directly movie. from the movie or a quote a like not necessarily a quote but like something to kind of hint at what the movie is yeah I, I would say yeah like it it could be yeah it could be both it could be like the quote from the movie exactly or like something that hints at it because one of my twists i have a quote in mind but i don't know what the tagline it could be so i think okay. either so way do a cool. quote if we don't get it with the quote do a tagline all right so josh okay. you started off all right so number five welcome to hell, motherfuckers. Is that a tell from the hood? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, what did you say? Welcome to hell. What did you say after that? He says, "Welcome, motherfuckers." <laughs> no, he, he says that while he's about to turn into the devil. Yeah. And then yeah. he has that little tongue. <laughs> he's like out of breath when he says it. He's like going crazy. Yeah, he's, yeah, he's getting fucking yeah. <laughs> he was <laughs> juicy mouthed. This yeah. ain't no funeral. No, it ain't the terror dome. Neither. I was like, damn, he's all sweating. <laughs> he was going. fucking losing it. Yeah, dude. So yeah. the 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 twist is. What? They're in hell. They're hell. Like, okay, you think they're in uh, the was the uh, it's like a funeral home, right? You think they're in a and funeral home to pick up home, drugs? Yeah, it, drugs. Yeah, yeah. twist they're in hell. And then you find out Crazy K's partners killed him after mm. he killed partners? you know killed him. Partners? What? Are they partners? Partners. <laughs> partners. Crazy K's? No, he said after you killed Crazy K, a few of his boys killed you. Yeah. So so it was like after they killed. Oh yeah 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 yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, they never showed it, but then again, you know, I guess they we can say. No, no, nah, nah, you get it, part. you get it. Yeah, yeah. It was um, just three caskets with their bodies in it, and they're like, "What the fuck yeah. are we doing here?" I'm pretty like, sure, nah, like, I'm pretty sure when, when people first saw that, they were just like, "Okay, I know where this is going," because he said the drugs were in the in the. Coffin. I was lost. I was lost in the motherfucker. When I first mm -hmm. saw it, I did not guess that. Yeah. Are oh, you talking about when you saw the when you saw the coffins? The coffins. Yeah. Uh, okay. When I first saw the movie I when I was younger, when it first came out, I had yeah. no idea that that was the twist. Mm -hmm. I didn't mm -hmm. even get it because I saw it when it first came out too. I didn't even get it when they were looking at this. So I was like, "What the fuck is going on?" Still, until he said, <laughs> "This ain't no funeral <laughs> home." I was like, "Oh, it's not." <laughs> I was just as lost as them. Like, it's not. It's not a funeral home. <laughs> Like uh what was what's his name from um the wood? Sydney? Stacy. 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 Don't say my name. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, he was he was too LA in that movie though in Tales from the Hood. He was like, who was him? I was like, what the fuck did you just say? <laughs> who was what the hell him? You gonna, what the hell you gonna refry some beans? Why not cook that shit in the yeah. first place? <laughs> <laughs> the first time be up. Like, what? <laughs> what? Lamar, what's your number five? Uh Time is on my side. Yes, it is. <laughs> the fallen? Fallen. Yeah. fallen? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes. I fucking that that twist got me. And they tell you in the beginning. Cause in the beginning, he's like, This is a story about how I almost lost my life. Mm. And then they go through the whole shit. He thinks he you think Denzel gets killed? And then the, the ghost goes into the cat. And he's like, Oh, you wasn't listening. This is a story about how I almost lost my life. I was like, oh, shit. <laughs> oh, you got me. You got me. I actually what? haven't seen that movie in a while. I love that's, that That's one I need to rewatch for sure. The twist in that movie got me because I was like stuck. I'm like, oh, Denzel got him. He killed him. Then he killed himself. And then the fucking cat comes crawling out the house like, oh. <laughs> Have you seen it, Josh? Um, I've seen parts of it here and there. I couldn't. I couldn't really get into it as much as like other people have so mm -hmm. uh, i know what happens at the end yeah but like and i know what happens in the beginning like there's certain parts in there but i haven't seen it all the way through yeah yet. the the movie i don't remember i remember the beginning when he's like dancing to be executed yeah. and singing yeah. the song yeah and then mm -hmm. like his spirit is jumping from body to body and then at the end john goodman right mm -hmm. he's taken over john goodman's body yeah yeah and yeah, yeah. 
Denzel smoking, isn't he smoking a cigarette smoking or something poison. that's laced with, yeah, smoking poison. Smoking poison. Yeah. yeah. And so I remember, wait, all, I remember it, those things. Is, in the beginning, isn't, uh, what's his name, Casey Jones? Is he the one? Yeah, that Casey gets, Yeah, Casey Jones. <laughs> Casey Jones. Yeah, that's why I was like, oh, that's Casey, I forget his name. <laughs> Elias something. His name is Casey Jones. Saying, his yeah, there we go. Yeah. He, he, was, he was too happy to be seeing the electric chair, man. That shit was yeah. crazy. Okay. My number five, I don't know if you guys have seen it. Um, what can I say about it? Um, it's not a quote from the movie or anything. It's just like a crazy girl returns home and her, she thinks her stepmom's psycho. Go ahead and tell us the title. Yep. <laughs> uh, the Uninvited. Oh, I've, I've seen parts of it. That is that with um, what's her name? Uh, Elizabeth something. Elizabeth Banks or? Yes. Yeah, she plays okay, the I've, stepmom. Yeah, I've seen parts of that. Okay. Oh yeah, oh. she's stepmom, and then uh, the girl from Ghost Ship, uh, mm -hmm. Emily Browning. She's she's uh, she's the daughter, right? She's the daughter who goes to an insane asylum. Like when the movie starts, she's coming home from an insane asylum mm. and she returns home and her dad has remarried mm. and she believes yeah. that, her, that the stepmom had something to do with her mom who was sick dying. So the stepmom yeah. looks like the same age as her. Uh, is, am, am I looking at this right? Is the stepmom young? Um, Elizabeth Banks, she's, she's pretty, she looks pretty young. She, she looks, she's, Elizabeth Banks is from 40 Year Old Virgin. She was the one that was in the bathtub and was uh, masturbating in front of uh, Steve Carell. Then he left. The hoe. The hoe. Yeah. The, the whore. <laughs> <laughs> no, but that one was a good one. That, that one had a, a good twist mm -hmm. that I don't want to say because in case Lamar wants to watch it. It's, it's yeah, a good I want to watch it. I want to watch it. All right, number four. Okay. All right. So the first rule of movie title is you do not talk about, about movie, movie title. title. <laughs> Screams. <laughs> no. Is that it right? That's it right? No, no. It's not Scream? It's no. Fight Club. <laughs> what is it? I, he said the first rule about this movie is you do not talk about this oh, movie. Oh, you know what threw me yeah. off? Because you said movie title. So that's right when you said that, like that that's what I said, yeah, yeah I, I started thinking about the white dude from Blockbuster. Remember he was working at Blockbuster and he was like, first yeah. thing about scary movies. That's what my uh, mind went to. That's hell of, he was like, he was like, scream. He was adamant about it. I was like, scream. Like, I, I, was like, I was like, both y'all going to get it at the same time. Just because you said movie title, it threw me off. Uh, okay, it threw me okay. off. Fight Club, okay. Fight Club, yeah. Um, uh, I could just say Incredible. One of yeah. the most incredible, Not, well, two of the most incredible white actors ever. Yeah, I would, I would, ever. I would agree with that. Yeah, and uh, that movie well, because had me lost all yeah. the way to the well, end. Well, lost. Way, it didn't have me lost. Mm -hmm. I just thought it was a good ass movie, and mm -hmm. at the end, I was like, "Wait, what the fuck? Like, wait, wait." Yeah. What, 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 See, I was like, right when we talked about it last time. I said, "Didn't he shoot talk. himself in the mouth?" <laughs> you said what? I said, "Didn't he shoot himself in the mouth?" And you guys were like, "No." Shoot himself in the mouth. Oh yeah, he shot he himself did. in the mouth yeah. at the end. Like he's yeah, trying to kill. He was trying to kill Brad kill. Pitt. I don't yeah. know if he shot himself in the back of the brain or like back of like. No, the no neck he or shot, I when he shot himself. I literally just watched it the, over the weekend. When, when uh -huh. he shot himself, he angled it like it was going to be through the back of his brain, but it came out like right here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like mm -hmm. he didn't. He didn't really shoot himself in the mouth. I mean, uh, he didn't shoot yeah. himself in the head. It was like in his yeah. out of the mouth. It was through here. Yeah. yeah. Well, I would say like I like how they did it because they when. When they're talking to each other, there's like not anybody else around that they're talking to. It's but yeah, always like, but you just don't notice it. They they you don't play notice it so not. normal yeah. that yeah. you just do not notice it. Yeah, because one minute like it can be him fighting somebody, right? And the other minute it's him announcing things, but they're not in the same place right. together with everybody else. But around you just them. don't even pay attention because they're so they're so like yeah, not yeah. about it. It's like you just yeah. think they're just two crazy dudes doing all this yeah. shit together. Yeah, and then when you go back and watch, it's like okay, it makes sense. Like. Yeah, it's one of those things where like, oh, did I miss something? Nah, nah. Somebody else was talking to him, and you watch it again, you're like, realize, nah. It's just and it's like it's, it's one of those movies you're like, nah, because they were there and they were both talking to him, and uh, yeah, you know, they, yeah. They, when they play it back, you're like, oh no, they weren't. No, nah, no. Nah. There's there's even like a part where 
uh, you know, the person that Edward Norton was talking to, what's that girl's name? Helen Bowen Carter. Yeah. When and she then, reacts to him. Yeah, yeah. When, but when Brad Pitt takes her to the house, you know, he's like talking to Edward Norton's character and she's all, who, the, who are you talking to? Yeah. Like, knowing, knowing yeah. it could be, yeah, yeah. Like, Cause she's in the like, room. Like she's in a, she's in the yeah. bedroom and he comes to the yeah. door and he's like, who yeah. are you talking to? He's like, no, I was like, shut up. And he slams the door. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. And then she so was like, like she was tripping because he was like bipolar. Like one minute yeah. he's like wanting to fuck with her, and the next minute he's like, like what the fuck are you doing here? So yeah, because like, he can't. Yeah, because she yeah. Yeah. yeah, she came down yeah. from the room and she came in the kitchen. And he's like being an asshole, and she's looking like fuck. She's like, like fuck what you, the and hell? she just left. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And in the movie, you kind of like, what is her problem with him? Like, yeah, bro, yeah. Him. <laughs> this is what I was thinking when I was watching the first time. Like, you cheated on him with the fucking. You knew he liked yeah, him. Yeah, you fucking bitch. Yeah. <laughs> that shit was that was fucking fantastic. That twist is fantastic. All right, Lamar. My number four. Do you believe in God? Devil's advocate. Do you believe in God? Are you like li literally asking me? That was twice. <laughs> Do you believe in God? Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. <laughs> uh, crazy as hell. Because yes. <laughs> <laughs> you, you said it, you had to say it three times, and then Damn. I was like, wait, hold on. Yeah. <laughs> I thought Tasha you were really like, asking me. Like, oh, wait, are you asking me? <laughs> no, I was, I was too, and then Tasha beat me to, the, to asking that, and then you kept on saying and I'm all like, Oh shit! We better not. <laughs> I forgot. I forgot about no, that. One. I do. I do believe in God. I believe in God. <laughs> no, Tasha was like guessing the movie, and she looked when I said it again. She was like, "Wait, are you asking me?" <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think that's another thing that maybe like that another hint that was like, "Oh shit, he's talking about." Because uh, I remember what you said about him rejecting it five times. Three times. Right? Three oh, three times. times. Oh shit. Okay. Okay. But yeah, I mean that's if you haven't seen the movie, if anybody's watching this hasn't seen it, you need to see it because that I just the the whole way that world was going, just to come to the end, and they don't. It's not like a, it's not like a whoop bam ah, but it's just like a because the way he it's revealed is so relaxed. They're just sitting there looking at him. They're all sitting there around the fucking devil, and they're just looking at him. And he yeah. walks in like no, nah, no, nah. and, the, and like, their true here. form too. Yeah. Mm. That twist was like so calm and so, like I said, at the end of the movie, I was like, that was crazy as hell. I didn't even think that I'm saying that's crazy as hell. <laughs> that's, that's the reason the why the they movie. call it. Yeah. That's why they call it. In, in that, that movie, they didn't do a whole lot of like flashing back, like, remember this? This is what you thought, and this is yeah, what actually no, happened. They that's why I said at the end, they just kind of left you with it. Like, yeah. you're in hell. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I'll say this about like Tales from the Hood, because they, they go in hell too. And the de the devil looks cool, but the effects the other effects don't hold up because <laughs> everybody's just going like this. <laughs> and the fake fire like I forgot about that. <laughs> this, and then zoom out, and they were just going ah. Yeah, for real. Like, like back like, in the day, like, the, scary, the, the idea is like you know it's creepy, but then you watch yeah <laughs> roller coaster. Yeah, you know, imagine being coaster. an actor and just having to be there and doing it. <laughs> yeah. Like, I hope you make say, them look good. Well, yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah, nah, nah they should have just kept it on the devil laughing. That's the only thing. <laughs> <laughs> okay. The clue to my number four movie is Kevin Bacon's Schlong. Hello, man? Huh? Kevin Bacon's uh, Kevin no. Bacon? Is it like a new movie that came out? Nah, it's from the 90s. But it might be another one you guys haven't <laughs> seen. I need another Wrong. clue because I'm, yeah, I'm thinking Invisible yeah. Man too. Um, yeah, yeah. Uh, Matt Damon is a creepy professor. You talented Mr. Ripley? Matt Dillon, not Matt Damon. Matt Dillon, sorry. I give up. Wild <laughs> Things. Who knows Matt Dillon? Uh, I never Wild saw things. that. Never saw yeah, that. I didn't think so. Nah. What is it called? Wild Things. This is with, scary. Movie? Um, with the homegirl from uh, Starship Troopers. The um, the girlfriend the of uh, the main character, who the, the one pilot. that survived. Yes, who survives at the end. He's in it. Uh, the girl from Scream, the main girl from Scream, is in it. Kevin Bacon's in it, and it takes place in Florida in the swamps, and it's a twist at the end. Oh yeah, and Kevin Bacon's slong. I remember and his slong shows up in the shower. Yeah, really, yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the 
really yeah. good. Yeah, no, I've, I've, I, no, that so, one, that was a good respect. one. That's a good um, mm-hmm. twist. Was it 2004 game. or 1998? Because they have two of them. They have 1998. 1998. 1998. Yeah, because I was like, uh, you know, elementary school when that came out. Mm-hmm. So can't talk about it because you ain't seen it. So that's my number four. <laughs> number three, Josh. <laughs> number three. All right. Uh, all right. Here's a quote. Uh, fuck it. I'm just gonna do it. <laughs> and if you guys can't get it, I'll give you another hint. Uh, where's my daughter? What are you talking about? I am your daughter. The others. Yep. <laughs> others. Yes. Are you mad? <laughs> <I am laughs> your daughter. <laughs> That, the twist I, on that, the twist yeah, on that, on that fucked me up like nightclub. Like, it that, fucked me up. Yeah, that shit, like, okay, Sixth Sense, I don't know if that's on your list, but I already saw the ending yes. of that. I saw Sixth the Sense came out before, yeah. Yeah, I saw the ending, because we snuck we snuck in one theater to see the movie, and then we mm-hmm. snuck back in. I like, was there. What's up? I was there. You were there with us? What? We, we snuck about? in the theater. Really? We left the movie to go sneak in that one, uh-huh. and we all were in there <clears throat> to watch uh-huh. Six Sense. Remember the guy was uh, screaming from the top row, and no, he no, fell down the stairs to run out. Actually, no, I I went to go see a different movie because I was too scared to see it. And then I think like it was me and somebody else, and then I think my Sam and maybe okay. my mom or who else. Oh no, I snuck, it. Tasha, then, I snuck in with you. Lam- I remember exactly what it was. I just had to make sure that I had it correctly. We went to go we, watch Blair Witch. Exactly. Yep. We finished. And Blair that. Witch was terrible. We so snuck we, in. To we see were walking Sixth out Sense. and we snuck in to see Six Sense. And Six Sense was packed. We snuck in, snuck in, and we couldn't even sit yeah. in the seats. We had to sit on the side. Yeah. To mm-hmm. watch the movie. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yep. I remember that. Yeah. Um, yep. but yeah, we, we kind of, kind of snuck in, but we just, the movie was, I saw it was done early. So we just went into Sixth Sense for the last few minutes to meet up with the other people we went with. Mm-hmm. And I saw that Bruce mm-hmm. Willis was, was killed and that's the reason why. So I wasn't able to see it all the way through to be like, oh shit, did that, you know, did that make sense? Like, you know what I mean? Like the, the ending was already ruined for me. Uh, right. but what I liked about the others more is that, you know, throughout the whole movie, uh, now, when I saw the trailer for this, I thought this shit was gonna be scary. I didn't want to see it. Hell yeah! And, and, and then dad, and then dad's all, just close your eyes if you don't. If the scary part happens, <laughs> just close your eyes, and cover your ears. And I'm like, okay. And then that was like the first movie that really actually got me into horror movies. Mm-hmm. Like I that, that. Like Anthony was hell excited. Yeah, that was to the beginning. It. And then we switched, and then we switched. You know, I mean, like I saw other movies like Halloween. I mean, also, no, I mean, I, was scared. I, I mean, but, the beginning of you actually being like, "Fuck it, I'll watch it." Yeah, yeah, like, I'm going to start watching all these other horror movies I used to be right. scared of. And then Anthony, we just switched. He went the other way, yeah. Yeah, yeah. You don't fuck with love horror movies. <laughs> Others yeah. fucked Anthony up. And, they, uh, and it scared the hell out of me because of the fucking old lady. And then... That scene out, was terrifying. It she was, just yeah. the screen. Yeah, yeah, that shit scared the hell out of me. And then you see what you see what the twist is, mm-hmm. and I'm like, holy shit. Like, that yeah. was fucking brilliant. That I didn't was... see that. Nah. I didn't see none of that coming. Yeah, because you do see them interact with one of the kids, and you think it's right. uh, like a ghost. Right. And then now, and then you hear, and then when I watch it again, I'm all like, "Oh shit, it makes sense." Mm-hmm. Yeah. To where like, yeah, like, yeah, that was uh, it, it's it is slow, but like, it's still a good movie. But so, even yeah. when even when you find out that the staff is dead. Mm-hmm. You still don't realize that the, yeah, you the still mom and it. the kids are too. <laughs> no, nah, yeah, no. Nah, you're just like, well, I, I'm just assuming everybody's a ghost. That that aren't the mom and the kids. <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean? I'm thinking like this is a haunted house because you know I'm used to all these haunted house movies where there's just ghosts fucking with people. In the, yeah. You know, like I'm used to House on Haunted Hill, Poltergeist. You know, this this was the only movie where the so-called ghosts were actually, spoiler alert, the humans. Right. It, it, was, like, it, it was like you're so used to, to the ghost shit happening. It's like it was that, – that twist was like so out of nowhere. It nah. so yeah. so out of nowhere. And the way it begins, she's like screaming, crying, she wakes up. And then right. at the end, she told me like – not told me, but like she talked She about told how, you personally. She told, <laughs> like, she told me how – she told me how she – uh, she uh, like murdered her children and then killed herself and then mm-hmm. woke up and thought it was a bad dream. I'm like, no, you right. woke, you woke, you woke up and was it purgatory or <laughs> like? <laughs> thought it was a bad dream, bitch. You yeah, did. <laughs> yeah, for real. Because the husband he comes there like he didn't. I think he died in the war or something, but his spirit yeah. came back to say hello to her and then he leaves 
It was almost yeah, like yeah. um like how an American horror story the spirits can uh roam free on one night, like on Halloween night. Halloween. It was almost like yeah. that kind of thing with the with the husband. Like, like come to visit to... and then leave again. Yeah, because yeah, it, was, it was Halloween. But they didn't celebrate Halloween back then. Yeah. I don't know. They just I it don't was know October thirty first, <laughs> yeah. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I remember seeing that movie. I was I was taken to see it and I was like this movie is slow. Like, what the fuck am I watching? Right. And then the end was just like, oh yeah, that that made it up for because um the movie is really slow, but the end mm. makes you want to go back and watch it again to yeah. see, okay, what did I not catch? I'm like, oh shit, this what did I, okay, what, and, yeah. What caught me about that movie is I think that was the first movie I seen with those silent scenes. You know, when silent is silent, and then something happens. Mm-hmm. But it's not it's not too much, but it's enough to make you be like fuck. Right. Like uh you're yeah. like a door slam or some shit. It was like shit like yeah. that. Mm-hmm. Well yeah, that's, that's the, the the jump scares so effectively yeah. because it's just chill and all of a sudden like the part where they're uh they're laying down in bed and the kid, whatever his name, I think Victor. I forgot his name. Victor, yeah, yeah. Like the human kid, right? Yeah, yeah, but you think it's the ghost that's fucking with him and opening the uh, the sheets. Yeah, right, that made me yeah. like, holy shit! Like, I think the brother. Right. She's like, I think the brother's <laughs> like, oh, me, be quiet, man. You have imaginary friend, and all of a sudden, fucking. <laughs> yeah, I was like, oh shit. <laughs> then you see the shit, like, oh fuck you. <laughs> yeah, real. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's no, that, that's, that's, that's a, good that's a great one. Uh, your number three. Uh, my number three. Um. Uh, little boy with an imaginary friend that pulls the curtain. That what? And the others? The, the <laughs> <dad. laughs> All I heard was little boy with an imaginary friend. Because I didn't, I was like, I'm going to say the same thing. Because <laughs> I said something about the little boy thinking half. Yeah, he just said, he literally <laughs> just said it. That's why I was like, uh, little boy, imaginary friend, pull the curtain. So yours is, your number three is the others. Two, awesome. Yeah, because okay. that twist fucked me up. Yeah. yeah. That's that's a, and I didn't know how to feel about it at the end. Like, it's like, do I, am, do I, am I with the family that's dead? Or am I like, fuck them, you guys are ghosts. Uh-huh. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't know how to feel about it. And you know what, that's okay. What and the other thing, I remember, I like how the, the, the old lady said how the daughter possessed her. So, like, I was wondering how that happened. Because it creeped me out when you saw the do- daughter and she looks like the old lady. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like the old lady, yeah. And it was the old lady that felt like she was being possessed or like... Right, because it, it's yeah. like... Because during the movie, it's like they still think they're alive. So it's like, yeah. how does she know to possess this old lady? Yeah. But I like how they never showed the old lady. And like, you saw her in the drawings. Like, she drew mm-hmm. what they look like. And you see the, like, the drawing of the old lady, like, she looked like she'd be fucking creepy. Mm. Cause right. he like has these wrinkled skin, and the she has no like the eyes, yeah. And when yeah. and when she fucking opened that fucking closet right there, door, now, yeah. that shit, <laughs> fuck. Yep. And then they go up, they go upstairs. Like she, the co came in. I guess hears them screaming, goes upstairs, and they're all sitting around. And you're like, wait, what the fuck is happening? Right. And they're like trying to contact. You know, there yeah. was the the ghosts were the humans contacting the spirits who were Nicole Kidman right. and their kids. Yeah, and yeah, that, that shit, crazy. man. That shit fucking, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Genius movie. Okay. Oh, that's what I was going to do. My number three. <sighs> Voodoo in Louisiana. Oh, oh, Skeleton Key. I haven't seen none of these movies you got, Tyson. Yeah. <laughs> you haven't seen the Skeleton Key? <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, my God, that yeah. movie. That, that actually is a really good twist. And look it up. When I actually think about some of the things, I'm like, fuck. That's like, you know, yeah. with the- So after watching that movie, I legit sat in the movie theater 15 minutes after it ended, like, okay, what the hell just happened? So it's yeah. like, I had to like, okay, so this happened and then that happened, and that's why this happened. Like, I didn't the yeah. movie didn't end and I was just like, oh okay, yeah. No, I okay, had to sit I, there. I, I'm gonna describe yeah. a scene. Okay, was there a scene where like all the lights were out? The stove was lit. I think the boy. It was a boy. I mean, a girl and her little brother. And they're like driving to get the dad. No. 
No. This oh. one, it's um, this woman goes to take care of an old man who had a stroke. So mm. it, um, she's like a caretaker, and she's taking care of this old man who only lives in this big house with his wife. And it's an mm -hmm. old, it's, they're all white characters. Right. Except for one. <laughs> Speaking of uh, the, the friend, her. Uh, oh, yeah, Joy yeah, Bryant. Brent, yeah, do that. <laughs> <laughs> love with it. At the end, they're like, I wish we could get some more black people. Like, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. they, but they I'm always run out of the house. Shit, yeah, they always run. <laughs> 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 yeah. No, like, okay, this, that movie, it, it, it is really slow, but like, you have to pay really close attention to it. Because at it's the like end. It's like the others it, in the sense that it's slow yeah. moving, but the end is like, fuck. But, um, yeah, yeah. So yeah, so that's my number. I love that damn movie. Yeah, like I said, I want to watch it again. It's just it's it, you got to be in a you got to be awake. You got to be in a mood because right. lots of stuff happened, but it, it, it's it's a slow build. But the payoff is worth mm -hmm. it. But there yeah. uh, also there are things that are said and things that happen in the movie in the middle of it that you have to mm -hmm. pay attention to to understand the end. So mm -hmm. as slow as it is, you have to watch it. Yeah, got to pay attention. So. All right, so we on number two. Yep. Yeah. All right. Number two movie. Key to that chain is in the bathtub. Saw. Yep. <laughs> I I did not see that coming. And when he was like getting up at the end, I was like, "What the fuck is he doing getting up?" Oh shit! And I realized, <laughs> and I was like, "Oh!" And they find you find out who's the one shocking him, how he's able. To hear him, you know what I mean, like right. he was pretending to be killed with the poison. Mm -hmm. And he was holding the him. shocking thing too. Yeah, so. yeah. Dang. So, and you, you, you just like to me, it's like I was so caught up in the movie. I was like, "Holy shit, what the hell is he getting up?" Oh, he's the guy. And you never right. thought about like who's the guy in the middle because they talk about how all the how like uh, Dr. Gordon and Adam are connected to all these other things, but you, it never goes back to the guy that kills himself. Who supposedly had much you know, poison in them? You know what's interesting about Saw to me? Every mm -hmm. time I watched one, it's like I would just watch it as a movie. I don't even think there's a twist at the end until the twist happens. Every mm -hmm. time I watch mm -hmm. one, it's like mm -hmm. I'm just watching these people get fucked up. I'm not thinking what's gonna happen at the end, what's gonna be the twist. I never think about it until it happens, and then I'm like, oh, like, oh fuck, oh. yeah. <laughs> yeah but I'm always, I always watch it like, damn, you getting fucked up, you getting. I wonder like why you getting fucked up, but I never mm -hmm. think about the twist. Like mm. the boy being in the fucking safe, or the guy being part of it in the middle. Mm. I never think, I never even fucking like pay attention to that or care about mm. that for the moment until it happens. Then I'm like, oh shit. Yeah. yeah. And with, like that yeah. Whole time? In the second one, the other twist is too that all the people that were trapped in that room were arrested by that one cop, right? Right. That was like yeah. something that they pieced together. So. Well, I remember right. Tasha. Like, you you... Know... Oh, no, go ahead. I was going to say, I remember Tasha, you, uh, uh, you said something about how, like, uh, when Donnie Wahlberg came in to Jigs, like, was talking to Jigsaw, he's all, where's my son? And he's all, he's in a safe place. Mm -hmm. Right. And he looks, <laughs> and he looks at the safe. <laughs> like, right at, yeah, like... yeah, yeah. It's like little, little tiny stuff like that, <laughs> that yes. you got to pay attention to, because you're like, holy fuck. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but you're not even thinking, you're like, you're not even thinking about that. Nope. Mm -mm. That's that's the good thing when it when they do a movie that way where you're not yeah. you're just in you're just focused on what's happening and not trying to figure out like yeah. is this gonna help figure out what's to come like you're trying to figure out how to get out moment. of these traps you're not even yeah, thinking yeah. about why they're there yeah. or fucking uh, who's part of this you're thinking like oh you gotta do this to get out of that like yeah. you gonna sacrifice yeah. that's what you're thinking about yeah. yeah. So that shit is genius. The the twist on that is genius because you don't you don't even pay attention to that shit until it happens. Yeah, yeah, and then with the first one with the body being there, as you're watching the movie, you're like, oh, okay, well he put certain things, you know, there for whoever he's like right. testing. Yeah. And then he I said that there was poison in the blood, like mm -hmm. and he did he Just put a cigarette in the in no, the blood? He, no, like and the when he's uh, when Adam or Dr. Gordon's listening to the tape recorder, he's all like, "When there's that much poison in your blood, the best thing to do is shoot yourself or kill yourself." So, are you, like, and then later on, Adam had the cigarette and and he's dipping the it in the in, in the, the blood in the in the poison in the blood yeah. that you huh. know. No, no, so you're like, know. oh, he just placed this here for. Yeah, he he you know. made it look like right. he he put the cigarette in the blood and then he turned off the lights and he's all like, "Here's the plan." And he turns on the lights and he gets on the other <laughs> cigarette. 
and then yeah. Adam goes, he does this over the top thing of getting killed. And then, <laughs> right, he yeah, and then he shocks him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and uh, another thing about I saw is like, it was like, before I saw it, everybody was talking about it at school. And then somebody told me, oh, it's the old guy, it's the old sick guy. And I was like, it's for ruining the fucking movie. Um, but then again, I'm watching, I'm like, where the fuck is this old guy? I thought it would be just some like random person we didn't see. Oh, so right. they didn't do movie. anything. No, no, they, they didn't say it was the old guy in the middle of the room. Like that's that's the dead giveaway. So when I'd I watched and I saw that, I was all like, oh shit. Um, it, there's too many. There's too many. With that movie, there's too much shit going on for somebody to ruin it for you. Somebody could tell you something, but there's too much shit to pay attention to for you to even be like, unless they said some obvious like, oh, the kid was in the safe. That's mm, the only yeah. way you can ruin it. But it's yeah. like. There's too much shit to pay attention to. Or you even forget about it and be like, oh, that's the old guy. Like, it's, it's a lot of shit going on. <laughs> yeah, yeah. A twist to me, for me, is something like the obvious out of it. You know what I mean? Like, let's say, let's say if Saw, like, um, the ending was, you think it's Zep, and then all of a sudden you see, like, the guy come from behind the door and, like, actually, it's me. Like, it wasn't, if it wasn't, the, you know what I mean? Like, Wait, you do know, that again. <laughs> you, know, what's up? What's up? you know, like, it is a it was like, like it's it's me. Me. <laughs> actually, you didn't see that one coming. It's like some some ones you don't see it coming because it's like it's you know lazy writing or like yeah that's how I feel. Um, like that that's what that's what made Saw one hella like shocking because it was like right in front of you the whole time. And right. you weren't, you weren't, you were going to be like, man, wouldn't he breathe, wouldn't he move? But you just like, well, fuck. If you see, two guys see a dead body in the middle of a room where they're chained up, you're like, fuck him. We need to get yeah. this situated. You know, you're not looking for him to make a breath because you think he's dead. So I thought, right. like, that's the reason why I thought it was genius. Lamar, what's yours? <sighs> I haven't seen this movie in so long. I don't have any quotes. Um, you're not, you're not really a cop. This is all fake. Oh, uh, Shutter Island. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Wrong Leo movie. Sorry. <laughs> What'd you say, John? Was you that said Inception? Oh, Inception, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, like I said, when I watched that movie and Leo at the end was like, nah, you guys are lying. I was with Leo like, you guys are fucking lying. No, there's a murderer here. <laughs> And they were like, no, you, this whole thing is made up. Uh -huh. I, I still didn't believe them until he said something to Leo, and Leo was like, no. Nah. And the guy looked at the uh, the other guys, and he just shook his head like, like no, nah, he still thinks he's solving the case. Yeah, yeah. That was the mm -hmm. only time that. I believed it. Oh, you're talking about at the that, end when... Um... Yeah, when he's sitting there talking mm -hmm. to him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's telling him, like, you're not... He was like, you didn't. the gun wasn't even loaded. And he's just like, no. Nah. And then when he looked at the guys, like he gave him the cigarette to smoke. It like no, first he act like he believed him, mm -hmm. and then he lit the cigarette. And then Leo starts whispering like, "Yeah, so those guys over there." And he kind of looked at the guys and was just like, "No, nah, he's still yeah, believing. like no, nope, yeah. he's well." One thing he's, he's all the, the, yeah. when he said when he said after that he's all you know you want to uh, die a hero or like live a monster or die a hero. Didn't he say something like after that when he was I walking off? So, um, oh yeah, like I remember he said something. So there's been like. Some people like uh, oh, it's a conspiracy theory that he actually wanted the lobotomy because they were going to give him that if he right. wasn't if he couldn't come to terms that he's not a you know detective. Mm -hmm. So yeah. that kind of hinted at like maybe he was aware but just wanted to just go out that way. Like I don't know if they were going to give I him. I thought he just account. wasn't yeah. aware. I thought he was just really convinced. Like I'm here to solve a crime. Well, yeah, well, yeah. That's it goes both ways. It's like when he makes that thing. It's like is he still the person acting like who's, right, who's in denial right. or is he coming to terms but he's using this way to like die the hero that he believes he is or like, like giving in giving in almost yeah 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 but want to have oh, that yeah. image of you still have that image of yourself before right. they fucking make you a living zombie because right. they were they, they were going to lobotomize him i believe because they were in a sane asylum right were yeah, they going yeah. to or did they already no, I think, I they, think were they were going to. Going to because when he looks that that look that Mark Ruffalo gives him is like, nah, he's not. Yeah, he's not better. We're gonna have to. He looked at them like, yeah, we gotta yeah. do it. Like, and then at the end of the movie, 
you know, they're, they're in this building. There's, you see the outside of this building with the lights on, and it's like maybe that's the place where they, they take them to. Yeah, yeah, because, you know, I mean, I'm pretty sure you're not going to show. You kind of fucked yeah. up if you show the main guy, our hero. Because Mark <laughs> Ruffalo's that, character, yeah. Mark Ruffalo's character was also a doctor, right? Or was he actually a detective? No, he was he was a doctor. He was I think all of them were a doctor. And was he, he was one of those doctor doctors that was like, yeah, yeah, he was like wanting the lobotomy to be the last resort? I yeah. think, yeah, I think he was yeah. like that. Like, I can convince him or I can, I, I can wake him, not wake him up, but like, I can get I him know, to see I, or without yeah. having to well, do that. Well, because uh, Ben Kingsley, the main guy, the main, the, the bald headed guy mm-hmm. was like, you know, this is like the, was they were like saying this is the biggest role, role play or uh, acting job anybody's taken on for this type mm-hmm. of thing. So it seems like they were all trying to just experiment to see if it could help this guy come to without terms with what it. Yeah, yeah. So it seems like all of them were trying to, like, we're in on it, trying to help them, but it just was no use. I believe so. them all the way to the end. I was with Leo to the end. Yeah. Like, no, fuck you guys. <laughs> <laughs> There's a killer here. He's going to solve them. Well, it's, yeah, so I, thought, <laughs> I was like, because I thought, like, I thought, like, you know how, like, certain people, uh, not certain people, but, like, when you go, when they go to a same asylum, the main character, I'm thinking, like, these guys are in it. These guys are pretending yeah. to help them. And then they're on. You find out they're the ones that are the monsters. Right. Right. You know. Right. Yeah. Yeah. A uh, quote from my number two is "Stuttering Stanley." <laughs> uh, Freddy Krueger. Is that Freddy Krueger? No. 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 Oh, no. 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 Fuck. 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 Stanley. Uh, stuttering Stanley. Stuttering. I know Stanley. that movie. <laughs> oh. I know that movie. It's stuttering Stanley. Can't think the of guy it. was a killer because he was like, "Don't make fun." <laughs> Water boy? No, <laughs> no, <laughs> no, no. Uh, Lamar, Lamar got it, but it's uh... not because I've heard that quote before. Yeah, ah, uh, he's a ki- is a he's a killer, right? The sixth no, sense. No, the sixth sense. Yeah. Uh, okay, okay. He wasn't a killer. No, but the, it was, the teacher did start stuttering when the uh, the main yeah he was like sense. don't yeah. make fun of me. <laughs> yeah 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 <laughs> Six the sense, little boy yeah. was yelling it at him yeah I remember yeah. that shit the, the ghost <laughs> told him that they called him stuttering Stanley so Stanley. yeah no I think that was the that movie was the twist of the century yes. at that time that was like but it, it was more scary than anything coming. but that twist was like what he's fucking dead. I think only one part made me jump, and that was when, when the girl was by the window. When the no, when like, the ghost like, of the woman right walked there. by the kitchen. So uh, no, not by the kitchen, by the bathroom. He was peeing. He got up in the middle of the night to go pee, and then yeah. like the ghost walked by, and it was a loud like you know the music that they do. That's yeah, the that only did. part that made me jump. The part that made me jump is when he's sitting with his mom, and he's like, uh, "The biker lady got killed." She's like, how do you know? He was like, she's standing by your window. And they turned the camera to her, and the lady just looking in, like, and she walked away. I was like, bitch, get away from the window. Like, why are you sitting here staring at him? Why are you staring at him? Leave him the fuck alone. And the the thing that that was movie, That movie had the same effects as Fight Club, because Bruce Willis is talking to people, but they don't hear him. Like, he's sitting there trying to interview Mm -hmm. the lady. And the lady's not responding, and you think the lady's just not responding, but she, how, she, she doesn't fucking hear you. Isn't that how it is with the when he's with his wife, that he's talking to her at the dinner table? But he thinks yeah. she's just being, being like she's just mad at right, him, man, just man, like yeah. giving him the cold all, shoulder because yeah. she says happy anniversary, and she's right, pretty and much gets just her walks away. She, but yeah, she's talking to herself. But when you first saw it, see that's the thing. Like I can't I, since I know the twist, I can't you know. Mm-hmm acknowledge that because I know he he's dead already. So and I don't have yeah. that effect. I don't have that thing of like seeing it for the first time and see him interact oh, with Oh, you say you missed all of that the first time. No, because I saw the ending, the oh. very end. Okay. okay. Yeah. The sixth sense, what was great about it too was when you first watch it, it with the ghosts and everything, you're like terrified because you're like, oh my God, yeah. you think ghosts, you think they're like there to be me there were some mean ones, but Mm-hmm. It turns out that they just needed his help, so they were showing yeah. up, and they were showing up, and it was scary. But because like, I would say, yeah. I would say, it was it was way more scary watching it in that packed ass theater, 
But then when I watched it later, I was like, oh, it wasn't that scary. But it was just in that theater with mm -hmm. everybody screaming when shit happens. It was <laughs> way more scary. And for me, the second Very time scary. watching it, I knew what the ghosts wanted. So it was like, they're not trying yeah. to scare anybody. They're just trying to- Like the girl in the tent. The girl in the yeah. tent, it was like terrifying the first time. Like, yeah. what the fuck? Yeah. But she, then she was on, puking, but it was like, yeah. she because yeah. she was poisoned. Yeah. Um, yeah. But, yeah. but wasn't it like, didn't that kind of start like with Sixth Sense, the others, the Sarah Echoes, where the ghosts were the ones that actually needed help because even with Lies Beneath, even with, with Lies Beneath, like mm. the ghosts aren't the main antagonists, it's the people that killed them. You know it's I mean? kind of like they trying a, to get a, them to solve their murder, murder, basically. Murder, yeah, yeah, yeah. But like when you see it, you're thinking, like, oh, this is it a ghost comes story. off this terrifying, is... yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But that was, I was like, man, I wish I could experience the sixth sense again for the first time. That first time, that shit was like, I thought that was the scariest shit ever until I watched it at home. Like, mm. oh, it was Because it's a good movie, movie but, when you like, yeah, we it was, watch like, it, it was like a great movie. You don't get that feeling again. Yeah, especially when you come out of fucking Blair Witch. We were from Blair Witch to that. We were booing in Blair Witch. Like, what the fuck was that? We were literally yelling. What the fuck did we just watch? And Lamar, I think we went with your mom. I think we all went. My mom with Nikki. We went everybody. It was hell of us. Yeah. We were going off in there. What the fuck did we just watch? Two six cents. All right, John, what's your number one? Oh uh, man, I'm gonna get shit for this. <laughs> oh, uh, Lord. Ready? All right, ready? No, yep. I am your father. Uh, Star Wars? Star Wars. Yep, Empire Strikes Back. You're such Split a nerd. Seven. I knew you were gonna say that. <laughs> That's why I said yeah. Well, okay, you know what? But you know what? It probably hits different because you care. I don't give a shit. But it probably hits because you were probably like into it. I saw Star Wars when I was young when it first came out, and then after that, I didn't give a fuck. Like I don't. Mm. I did. It didn't linger on. I wasn't like, oh, that was amazing. I just didn't care. Like yeah, I, I, I was not into it. Those aren't my it, kind nothing, of movie either. Yeah, like sci-fi fantasy type movies. No, no, those are, those are mine. You know, got I don't care about the storyline like that. I didn't yeah, even actually. think about that movie to be honest with you. When we were putting this list together, <laughs> I did not think about Star Wars. Well, because yeah. there's like, have been on my list there's, still. There's been a like movie twist that I, you know, like yeah, there's the Sixth Sense, but I couldn't include that because I already knew what happened. At the end, but you already knew uh, what happened with Star Wars. But the you way they knew did it, he was Luke's father. Yeah, but the way they, <laughs> but the way they, the way they, they did it, it was genius. You know, <laughs> I wish I could have been there at first. You know, so no, I. True, but yeah. you know what? A lot of people think. A lot of people that watch it at that time say that they say that is the biggest. The biggest, yeah. Because yeah, yeah, so I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Like what other movies where you find out the main villain was the uh, the main character's father? You know, like uh, I didn't know that. Was up? Yeah, Watch well, it. that came out 2004. This movie, Star Wars, came out in the <laughs> 80s. So maybe that's where uh, <laughs> I want to get their ideas from. <laughs> yeah. And reading up, like the guy who made the first movie, he didn't even think about that. So when he made right. the second, there was a different director who was like, you know what? Because you think his father's dead in the first one. And then the guy in the director was all like, hey, this makes sense to make this guy the father because we say he's dead, but we don't know the whole story. So right. that's the twist. They didn't tell any of the actors. Even James Earl Jones, the voice of Darth Vader, was all like, wait, what? Is this for real? Like everybody wait, thought, Darth like, Vader's like, not a white man? Yeah, wait, what's up? <laughs> no, <laughs> man. Blackest brother in the galaxy, new being God. <laughs> Until that sixth woman, they pulled his mask off, you know. <laughs> but like I said, it's like that. I, I can't argue with that because a lot of people feel that way. I just didn't care enough. Yeah. But if no, I, I mean, cared, I would probably feel that way. I mean, you know me. I'm a nerd. You know, I like all types of things. You know, I ain't nerdy, fantasy, man. Like, 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 <laughs> okay, Lamar, what's your number one? Uh, um, oh, uh, uh, rule number one about Untitled is you don't <laughs> movie title. <laughs> movie title. <laughs> <laughs> scream too. Oh, I was like, oh, scream. <laughs> scream. Guys, <laughs> poor Tasha. I'm right. <laughs> <laughs> no, Fight Club is Fight, Fight Club just because I love the movie so much and then I love the twist, but it's one of those movies I can keep watching even though I know the twist. Mm -hmm. It like, is a crazy I, ass I movie. Love it. Yeah. It's hella Good crazy and it's hella movie. funny. Yeah. I fucking love it. And you know I love fucking 
And Norton. Nicholas Cage? Redford. Edward Norton and Nicholas Cage. <laughs> I, okay. I can't, I can't, I can't agree with him. <laughs> I can't. Edward Norton and Nicholas Cage, man. No, Y'all gonna start Edward, respecting Nicholas Cage. Edward Norton, Edward Norton, nah, like even even Woody Harrelson's better than Nicholas Cage, man. I like. What? I mean, do you like Woody Harrelson? Do you like Woody Harrelson? I like Woody Come Harrelson. On. Yeah. I like Woody Harrelson. I, yeah, I like Woody Harrelson. Yeah. Okay, my number one is. <laughs> The others. <laughs> Where the cuttings? That's, that's my British accent. That's my British accent. Where are the cuttings? Oh my, what did you say? <laughs> Having a party, huh? <laughs> I mean, Put another shrimp on like, the bar, man. <laughs> I think I, I honestly feel like <laughs> that was terrible. Hey, Mike. I, I, you guys are on whole other languages. <laughs> That was Australian. It's not even close. Good day, mate. <laughs> well, the cuttings, mate. <laughs> you sound like y'all from London. Hello, governor. 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 Well, I get it. I get it. I have bad feet. <laughs> others is my number one. Uh, for yeah. sure, for sure. Because the sixth sense the best, is that's is probably like, the best twist out of all of them. No, the yeah, others is like the best twist. Yeah, out of all the of sixth them. sense yeah. like kicked it off, but I, the others I enjoyed the others so much. I can watch the others. I will put that on before I put the sixth sense on. Yeah, because the others, the others keeps you in it. For so fucking long, and then they twisted, yeah. and you don't know how to feel. Like, damn, am I with yeah. the family? Or am I? Well, I like the people. What's the name? The the ser- oh, they the servants that came to help mm-hmm. them. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. I'm just like wondering, like, what, what the fuck? Because they keep on talking about like, I think the 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 children are onto it, but the mother doesn't know. And I'm like, yeah, what are you talking like, about? Because they, yeah, they were yeah, weird yeah, as yeah, fuck, yeah. but they wouldn't yeah. leave. They, they were weird as fuck. Yeah. Well, one that of them didn't talk. Twisted. She didn't mm-hmm. talk because of what whatever happened. The, yeah. the, the plague yeah. that got him. Yeah, Tuberculosis, yeah, yeah. right? Was it tuberculosis? One of those. I think, I think it was tuberculosis. It's been a while. Yeah. Old ass. Yeah. 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 And yeah. then it was like oh, they, they the found the pictures shit. of the dead people. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah. They were like, yeah. they were po- uh, uh, posed for the portraits, but they were dead. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I remember that. And they were outside, and that uh, that's, that's when you figure out, like, you know, what was it? The son, the son that was hesitant. And the the uh, the sister started believing that there were ghosts. Okay, they right. found the headstones. They found the headstones with their names on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah and that's when yeah. the kids found out because um, at first Wait, they the- were covering the headstones, and then finally uh-huh. they were like, "Okay, we need to get them to see what's going on." So uncover the headstones, and that's and the kids found them. Yeah. Wait, was it Nicole Kimmon that found the picture of them dead? Yes. Oh, okay. Yes, yeah. so she found the picture as the kids found the headstones. So they. Figured it out right. at the same time, and that—that that was a real thing, right? Back in the day, I guess so. Huh? I think so. Like, cause I remember Dead Silence. Taking pictures of the bodies. Yeah, cause Dead Silence, they did the same thing too, where they would take pictures of people dressed up, like sitting down on their couch or whatever. I mean, I saw in a couple of films. I'm like wondering, is this some shit that they got, and like something that That's usually happened? Maybe, yeah, maybe course, it's yeah. a British thing. <laughs> oh, governor. Uh. Have you guys seen High Tension? Yeah, I forgot about that one. That, that's an honorable mention. That's an honorable mention. Yeah. And uh, okay. Usual Suspects. Yeah, that was another one. Shit, that's another honorable mention. No? So nobody had this movie on their list, and I think it's probably going to be the answer to my question. Would you say Get Out is a twist or is just a surprise? Get Out, it's a... Uh, it's... Would you call it a twist, twist or it's just like a what, reveal? What, what 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 part of the movie do you would you say would be the twist? The the, um, the family being um, right when they find when he finds out they're trying to fucking uh, yeah that they take black people and yeah. transplant them like that was the twist. So or, it's more it is more yeah. of a surprise than a twist. It's not really a it, a twist is us us is a twist. The get out is not really a twist. It's more like a surprise or more like a fuck. I knew it because uh, yeah, us the twist is that the girls switch places. Yeah. Or that, yeah, I think that would twist. be a surprise too, though. No, that's a twist. 
because you don't know that, that yeah, that's, 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 yeah, yeah. Okay. that yeah that's yeah that's yeah that's more of a twist like get out you know I, i'm thinking like they're being brainwashed but now nah, they're just switching brains that's all so right. i you guess you kind of know it, so you kind of know these people you know they're up to something so it's, yeah, yeah, it's, it's kind of not like a twist it's like what are they up to so yeah, there's yeah. a difference between a twist and a reveal. So with with Get Out, it's more like revealed that this is what they do. Not yeah. necessarily right. like right. they do this, but yeah. actually it's this. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Like to me, it'd be more of a twist if you thought like they were actually good people, and then you find out. Right, that would be they, a twist. Yeah, yeah. Like, and I guess if anything, if anything in that movie is a twist, it's the girlfriend. Yeah, uh, I, I it, it, it would be because I'm saying because, no. I'm saying if anything would be the twist. Oh yeah, yeah if yeah, anything, yeah. because yeah. she played like she was with him the whole time. Yeah, like she played like yeah. she was shocked about everything. But she yeah. actually brought him into the whole thing. Others.